Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of my vlog. In this episode of my vlog, I'm going to attempt to do a jump cut throughout the vlog using VLLO, the free version. So if you're interested in that, keep on watching. Alright guys, if you're new here, my name is Sadon and I vlog about my life and my YouTube journey. Consider subscribing if you want to know what it's like to grow a YouTube channel and my life here in Kuala Lumpur in general. Alright guys, the way I understand it, a jump cut is when you take out any pause and ums in your vlog or in your video so that your video or your vlog would go out smoothly. If you are starting out on YouTube and you are using one of uh, these free editing software, it might be difficult for you to get that jump cut to flow smoothly because the editing software wouldn't allow you to get that smooth uh, transition that you are looking for. But with the free version of VLLO, it might be possible to do that um, and I'm going to demonstrate to you how it can be done so i'm going to take a clip here where i pause here and i might be thinking on my next line so i'm going to show you guys how i uh, make a jump cut for this particular uh, take all right guys i'm in blo now and i'm going to pick up that clip uh, to demonstrate how we can use we can do a jump cut using the free version of VLLO so you need to go to the clip that you want to do a jump cut on so that's the clip So I'm going to take a clip here where I pause here. So that's going to be the first cut. So it'll be around there. I need to look at the waveform at the middle of the screen. So I think it will be just about there. Uh, So when I want to do a cut, I need to click on the clip and then I need to hit on the split, the scissor icon at the bottom left of the screen. And I can uh, rewind it to see that I have cut it at the appropriate place. Pause here. Pause here. So that could be a little bit too early. So if I want to redo that, I need to click on the redo icon on the left of the clip. Here. So let's do the cut there. Here. And I might be and then I'm going to perhaps put it around there to make the other cut. So I need to click on the split, um, the scissor icon. And I'm now I can delete the middle section of the clip to make a jump cut. So I'm going to do that now. So the, the result will be something along this line. Pause here and I might be thinking on my next line. So that's going to be my next cut. In my next line. Just about there. So I'm going to show you so perhaps around there uh, 
fine. So I'm. Um, so I can delete the middle section again. So I'm going to show you guys how I uh, make a jump cut for this particular. So I might want to uh, delete the when I said a. Uh, uh make it so be around there uh make a jump oh i uh, i I make a jump cut for this particular uh, take. All right, I set another uh, there, so I want to um, take that out. A uh, take. Uh, this particular. Let's see if I get that right. Particular uh, uh, So it could be a little bit too much, so I need to redo that. A uh, tick. Particular. Uh, Let's see whether I got, I got it right this time. Particular. Uh, mm, no. So this is why I don't do a lot of jump cuts because it can get quite frustrating because you you can't really get the exact point where you want to uh, cut it you can try to pinch on the screen to make it bigger or to make it slower i'm going to do that now no that's not working so i'll just have to do this the manual way by trying again cut for this particular all right let's see particular a uh, take okay let's see if I did get get it right this time around and I need to trim the end To trim the end I can click on the until now icon to trim it and I think I need to trim the beginning as well maybe just slightly there so I'm going to take a clip here where I pause here and I might be Wait a minute, did I start the clip with saying so or did I say something else? So I'm going to... Right, I did start with a so. So I'm going to take a clip here where I pause here and I might be thinking on my next line. So I'm going to show you guys how I make a jump cut for this particular uh, take. Alright, that looks alright to me. So that's how you do a jump cut. It can get quite frustrating. But I'm sure if it's a bigger screen then that 
where you can make a difference because it will be easier for you to manipulate the timeline to get that exact to get that exact moment where you need to cut the clip and where you need to uh, put it back together again so yeah that's how i do my how you can do a jump cut on a free version of the app uh, the vllo app so by far this is the best free apps that i've used to do a jump cut because for the other apps that i've used a few of them is just not possible to do it the volume the voice would go down uh, and it's a big mess so this is the best so far but of course if you are using a better editing software then you might get a better result all right guys that's all for this episode of my vlog don't forget to like to comment and to subscribe and until the next episode bye for now